Uh, Rajiv ji, my question is, there's a lot of uh, convergence happening in India right now, uh, in the states of uh, Kerala and uh, Tamil Nadu and Andhra Pradesh, my uh, native, uh, native home village. So now there are people who acknowledge that they, their forefathers were converted into Christianity, but still they say because of the oppression from the ruling class or the Brahminical or the other caste for that matter, the Dalits they got converted and how to rehabilitate, rehabilitate them and bring them to the main society because they are neither there nor no, but there. But see, art of living has no caste discrimination, right? Ramakrishna mission doesn't, Chinmaya mission doesn't. I name you that most, the top 20 or 50 or whatever modern uh, dharmic organizations that are popularizing, that are spreading, none of them have caste discrimination. So I think that that is also an overused excuse. Maybe it is in certain pockets and maybe it is in certain strata and that is where we have to go and fix that problem. But the conversion is going on in all strata. The conversion is going on in very elite strata where there is no discrimination. Those guys are very rich people who are converting. A lot of people I know that. They are converting. So it is, it is only one segment of conversion is poor people based on oppression that we should acknowledge and we should correct. But there is many other kinds of conversion also going on. And uh, again, uh, uh, in this, the, the conversion whole process. And conversion is not only to Christianity. There is a very soft conversion to Islam called Sufism. It's a fashionable thing to go and say, ah, Sufi, and, and t- put some pan in your mouth and Sufis. Yeah. Exotic this uh, aestheticization of the Sufi is a very popular thing in Delhi. And uh, how to Bollywood th- movies doing a lot of uh, uh, soft Islamization of. Uh, how to, check it, how to check it and stop it? No, you, you can't do use state machinery. You got to wake up and have your scholars. Uh, scholars respond. You got to have your own gurus become wiser and smarter. And they should stop saying things like uh, all religions are the same. They have to become less politically correct and teach people the reality, become more audacious. So, you know, it has to be, it is, in, it is a battlefield of ideas. Conversion is a conversion of mind. It is not physically anybody doing it. Conversion means your mind has switched from what it was to something else. Somebody has given you a different narrative and changed your mind. So if you want to fight the battle of conversion, it's a battle of ideas. It's a battle of arguments. So you've got to have people who are better at that. In any game, if you're losing, you just have to have better players. Uh, we have not invested enough in really seriously understanding doing poor paksha on the conversion process and coming up with good uttar paksha. We have not done a good enough job, in my opinion. Because the Garvapsi was a failure in India. It involved a lot of criticism. Yeah. Yeah. Please.